Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we are doing another live commentary on pretty much Crucible. So in today's video we are going to be trying out the Randy's throwing knife. Now I recently got this weapon and as you can tell I've never really used it for anything. So we're going to pretty much try it out today and we're going to see whether it is actually any good and whether it competes with the Mida. Now if you don't know the Mida is probably one of my favourite PvP weapons in the game it's a really good weapon and it's one that i do like and i think for this setup what we're going to use is blade barrage just a standard roll we're not going to go too sweaty with the armor i'm just going to use a knucklehead radar if you didn't know knucklehead radar is probably one of my favorite exotics and then i haven't really used a load of wolves ever since i've got it and i've seen a lot of people are using it so i thought i would try it out in pvp now we do have the actual catalyst that we do need to get, so hopefully we can get that in the future. And then we used this fire memorial last game or last video, so we're going to try out the avalanche. And that's pretty much it. Hopefully if you guys do enjoy these sort of videos or you do enjoy today's video, make sure you do subscribe. And I've noticed a lot of people that do watch the videos and continue to watch the channel don't have post notifications turned on. So if you click subscribe, next to that there's a little bell icon. And if you turn them on, you basically get notified when I do upload. So you can be one of the first people to the video. And it does help out the channel a lot. I'm going to set the like goal of today's video to 35 likes. If we could get that, it'd be amazing. And like I said, we are getting closer to 20,000 subscribers. So if any of you could help towards that, I'd appreciate it. But as soon as we're in the game, I'll start the video. Right, so I'm pretty sure this is an auto-firing scout rifle. And I think the stats look pretty good. It's just whether it is going to be better than the Mida. Like I said, I do want to try out the Lord of Wolves as well. See what that looks like. But as you can tell from the sidearm and the kill I've just got, it's pretty much outgunned him from up close. So first impressions of that kill, pretty decent. Now that auto fire, where you can just hold the trigger down, is really helpful. And I'm kind of liking this gun actually. Oh my god. This is honestly, probably might even overtake the Mida, in my opinion. Let's pick up this heavy, see what we can do with this. Vibration has gone in my controller and if any of you guys play with vibration on and when it goes off because your batteries are low it's the most horrible thing in the world and that is what's currently happening to me. But so far so good, let's try out this loads of wolf, see what this is like if we can and we've missed every shot. I'm gonna... It's probably not the best map to try this weapon out because it is pretty close range when you are inside. Oh, there is a guy behind me. Yeah. Holy shit. Now I know why people use this load of wolves. That guy got absolutely shat on. Are we going to be able to spawn trap him? Yes. No, it won't let me melee him. No way. Spamming the RB button, I just think fucking nice. This guy. He's such a prick. Why does he just run around with that shotgun? All the like, all these kills have come from that shotgun. Oh fuck off. Hard lie. Who even uses hard lie? He's here again. Fuck you, how do you like that, you prick? It's not very consistent though, like sometimes it'll take two bursts, sometimes it's one. 
But I suppose once you master that, it's probably going to be the best shotgun. Is that that kid? It is, isn't it? You know what? Fuck him. Come on. Look at me, shotgun. Have that. Teabag him. Now, usually I won't bother, but he's a little bit of a fucking idiot. Oh, he's teabagging me. <laughs> Fuck you. As long as I come above him, I'm not really bothered. Come on. Teabag him, teabag him. Dickhead. Have that. This is that shot, this is that shot, Gungar. Come on, come on, one more kill. We might be able to do this. Come on, this kid here. Push, push, push. Yes! That was a guy as well. We're about to win. Prime Engram, that kid got 15 kills. I'm glad we come above him. He would have actually done it, but for some reason. Oh, that kid's back in a game. Just gonna give him another tea bag. Why not? <laughs> I do prefer though the fast firing scout rifles. He's after me. He wants me. I don't know how I'm going to get out of this. That guy's not playing. I'll take the kill though. Fucking controller, no. Fuck, fuck. Did this last video. I think my charge is broke, guys. I need to get a new one. Fuck's sake. A lot of people are using the hard light. I think it has been buffed, to be fair. I think that's why. I'm pretty sure the recoil's been improved, which, let's be honest, it did need a big improvement. But Oh, this scout rifle's so good. I'm pretty sure he's just popped golden gun. So we're not going to challenge that. He's chasing me. Oh, you little bastard. How, how did that miss? What the fuck? I mean, the Lord of Wolves is really overpowered, I'm not going to lie. Probably a third of my kills have probably just come from this shotgun. But if you can't beat them, join them. It's probably the best way. Try it before it gets nerfed, because it will get nerfed eventually. See whether I can get my heavy back. I don't think there's that much left. 18 bullets. Still decent. Yeah, this machine gun though, guys, I wouldn't recommend this one. It's honestly not that good. Did okay there. 13 13. Let's see if we can get two wins in a row. Don't know what he was doing. Come on, come on, come on. Challenge. Oh, 
Oh, fuck you. He's going to win. To be fair, he's a decent player. And I can't really complain because he's used a hard light. So, fair play to him. Oh, well, we'll take second. I'm going to back out and obviously do the overview of the Randy's throwing knife. Not bad, 1.67. Decent little games, to be fair. And as long as we come up against this kid and we did better than him, I'm quite happy with that. So the Randy's throwing knife, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to give this weapon. Let's take a look. So out of two games, we managed to get 15 kills with this weapon, which is really good, to be fair, to say it's a primary. It's masterworked range. The stats on it honestly don't look that good. They're not really that good. However, for PvP, I'm going to give this weapon a 10 out of 10. Now, Scout Rifle, we didn't try it with Zen Moment. Maybe it would have been better with Zen Moment, but that kill clip really did help out. And obviously, Rapid it, maybe we should have run that. But we can always try that out another time. So I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Really good gun, would recommend it. It's quite hard to get though if you haven't got it already. But it shouldn't take too long. So that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe. And hopefully soon we can hit that 20,000 mark. And as always guys, I'll catch you in the next one.